Hello everyone, I hope you're having a great day today. It's so nice to see you. Right now, I'm not really in the mood because I started my period this morning. And so that automatically this like kind of pisses me off in a way because I get the worst fucking cramps. I'm feeling kind of sad lately. And it's like, partly it's a pattern because I am bipolar, so. And partly I think it's just cause I've just been under like stress and shit lately. So, fart. Right now me and my boyfriend are in the process oops, I forgot, of getting our own place. We're trying and we applied to one this is the second place we applied to and i'm pretty sure we're gonna get it but it's just like a lot of back and forth but i'm taking that as like a good thing because they're not like giving up they're like trying to get all the info they need from us and everything you know so it's not as fast as a process as i wanted it and thought it would be but it's fine the only thing is like if we don't get this one, then like low key, I give up for right now. Like I'm gonna need a break before I try again because this process has stressed me out so much and drained me so fucking much. Like I cannot explain to you. I'm with my ex again, but he's my boyfriend again. And it wasn't like a fast thing. Like we were just talking for a while and then slowly it turned into a relationship. And now we're moving in together. Okay, hello guys, update. It's literally six days later, almost a week later. Let me tell you guys, we first found this apartment, I mean this town home, um, the 10th I'm pretty sure. And then they told us that if we do the application today, they could hold it for 10, up to 10 days. And so our moving date would have been the 21st. And so they held it for us because there's this complications like with my landlord. It's literally almost um, August now. Like we have like a week left in the month. So this took almost a month. And so we better get it because I just called them. And one of the ladies, a couple of the ladies actually I talked to are really nice. One of them is like rude it's like she doesn't like me or something because she's been like so unhelpful and like so not communicative communicative like taking hella long to update me and stuff like what what is going on what is going on anyways i call her and she says it's not fully approved yet and so she has to talk to someone and she'll update me today okay but look almost everything is moved in boxes Boxes, box, boxes, cleared. Okay, it is July 27th. Yesterday, I was talking to the lady, the one that I don't really like because she's like not really good at helping me. Yesterday, she was being nice to me for the first time. Like she was sending me hella papers that I had to sign yesterday about about my service dog and so she was like sorry that um these are just not getting sent to you blah 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 oh my gosh guys it is the 28th and we finally got accepted yay i'm so sweaty right now guys we literally got accepted like last minute i feel like like i'm calling today me and mom are calling today da 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 da, -da like what's going on like i need to move out in like three days so like what's going on finally got it figured out finally got accepted today at like 12 50 i think 12 30 and so now i'm just in a rush trying to because we had to get so much done today like sign up for uh pge water bill da -da 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 -da, renters insurance that bullshit how to do all that how to go get the cashier's check and freaking they like gave us a higher deposit just because 
I don't have that much on my credit, like only six months of credit. But they didn't tell us that they were doing that until today as I was signing the lease. It was supposed to be like 700, mm-mm, 2,900. So that happened, but I'm packing, I'm packing, I'm packing. Rented a U-Haul too. So we're just gonna like pack the U-Haul tonight and then tomorrow we're going at 11 to do the walkthrough. Hopefully everything goes perfect. Hopefully everything goes perfect. Literally was looking online to look at other places because i was like i don't know like what's gonna happen and so i was looking at other places to go look at but they accepted us so yay this is just a lot this is like i've been dealing with this literally like all month and it's a lot it's a lot it's a lot but hopefully this is the last time I gotta move for a couple years at least. <sighs> Cause this shit is stressful, so. But I'm happy, I'm glad everything is working out. Hopefully tomorrow everything goes perfect. Um, hopefully no miscommunications, no, you know, nothing happens. I'm just gonna finish packing. Our empty U-Haul. It's gonna be filled up soon though. My room is so empty. Sleeping on the futon tonight. Excited about that. Good morning, it's moving day. We're moving out today. <laughs> yeah, I'm moving out today she said peace out the u-haul is finished packing we're just gonna do one trip in the u-haul so literally perfect fit <laughs> i'm finishing packing everything i'm almost done and then we gotta go to the town homes at 11 to do the walkthrough and then i think after that we're gonna start unloading everything and moving in are you ready for this? Are you ready for this? Okay guys, we are officially moved in to our new place. Look at all my stuff, look at all my stuff. So everything is inside at this point. Just need to like put it in the right places. I need to unpack, you know? Our apartment is literally right by the pool. Like we could see the pool from out here. <laughs> and I can hear the kids playing. <laughs> we have a half bathroom downstairs. We have a two car garage, even though we only needed a one car, so we have more room in there. We go up the stairs and look at this cute little loft. That's gonna be my office, like where I edit my videos, you know? Bedroom, this is gonna be the um, main bedroom. Bathroom closet i'll give you guys a way better tour when everything is actually set up you know i just want to give you guys a little sneak peek loft it's so cute and then there's so much storage in here which i love so much i love being organized here's the other room the thing is can not decide which bedroom should be the main one because this one has a bigger closet way bigger closet but the other room has a bigger shower it has a bathtub in it, so. But it's not too bad, not too bad. I think this one will be like where like I make my content, like do OF stuff, take pictures, like and store those clothes in there. And then that closet will just be like my everyday clothes. There's my dresser. This cute lob, and it closes, so that's cool. Like, I like that, I could just, Get out of bed and go in my office. We can also smoke in here. We can smoke in here. We can smoke in here. I literally saw it in the lease. It said we can smoke inside the leased premises. I can smoke in here, girl. That's what I'm most excited for. Cause I really thought like real shit. I was really gonna try to quit smoking because I didn't know if we could smoke. Um over here but 
luckily we can and you guys know what's also crazy my grandparents literally live less than five minutes away literally down the street it's my grandparents house i can walk there then the other direction walking distance is dutch bros what more can a girl ask for like i'm so excited right now we have to go and take the u-haul back um we still have some more stuff to unload as well but This is my new place. This is my first place without my family. So I'm a little nervous, but, and then look at this big pantry slash closet. It's so much room in there. Look, I'm go all the way down there. And boom, some room right there. I love it. It's 4.30 in the morning. I just woke up to take Ozzy to the bathroom. I got this shirt at Walmart today. <sighs> I'm so exhausted. I'm so exhausted. I don't look good right now, girl. Mm -mm. I'm gonna try to go back to sleep now. I'm just putting stuff away. All by myself. little wine glasses even though I don't drink but my boyfriend does so. I got these from Target I'm so tired but keeping it pushing I got my fat this morning I'm walked me and ozzy walked to my grandparents house it literally was like 13 minutes away 10 minutes away something like that smoked a few blunts walked back took a shower now i'm putting stuff away and my brother and his girlfriend are gonna pick me up at 11 to go and get some more food okay guys it's day three in the new house i'm pretty sure and i did a lot of shopping today costco and then home goods so i'm gonna just do a haul mainly home goods because costco is just mainly food here's how the fridge is looking it's not 100 percent organized but i'm gonna reorganize it got a big watermelon and then here's the freezer. Orange chicken. And I got white rice, but I'm not sure where it's at. First, got an air fryer. These are the cookbooks we got. One for air fryer, because we knew we wanted one. And then this one. I got this step stool because I can't really reach all of the cabinets in here. So I got a little step stool and I can store it right here in between the fridge and the cabinets. So I got a hand sanitizer just because it's good to have a hand sanitizer, you know? I got a Swiffer. Swiffer sweeper kit. It's hardwood downstairs and then carpet upstairs. So this big pack of band-aids because this is all I can find at Costco. Um, but I love band-aids, like very important. So batteries because just bound to need batteries at some point. I got a ring camera because I don't ever want to have to talk or answer my door for anyone ever um, besides like my family, you know, so got a ring camera and like I'm really scared when I'm home alone, so got a ring camera. <laughs> uh, this isn't like for the house, but it's a portable charger because it was back to school, so like back to school, <laughs> back to school stuff was out. So I got a portable charger. It was only like 10 bucks. One of the showers upstairs with the bath doesn't have the shower rod. So we got shower rod. Here's the shower curtain, just white. 
in the shower liner. Also got a trash can. Really needed one of those. A shoe rack. I think I just want to put it like by the front door for like the shoes we wear all the time. We got like a kitchenware set from my boyfriend's mom, but this was broken in it, and so I just got a new one. Hopefully, it fits in the drawer. Yeah, we're good. Nice. And I got dishwasher detergent um, to wash the dishes. Oh, and I got um, the shower hooks for the shower too. A cheese grater, but it's multi-purpose. It's a multi-purpose grater. This cute um, paper towel holder with the little thing on the top. Oh my gosh, I also got another deodorant because I can't find mine. So I got this one. And I got <laughs> medicine uh, planner, weekly pill planner, because sometimes I forget to take my medicine and sometimes I can't remember if I took my medicine or not. So this is going to come in handy for me. <laughs> Measuring cups, pair of tongs, and also got this utensil holder to put all like the spatulas, the tongs. I love organization, so. And also, I can't believe they're already starting to put Halloween stuff out. Just in time for when I'm decorating my house. But my boyfriend said he doesn't want it all to be witch themed. It's just kind of lame. Look at these cute cups. Aren't these so cute? I love, I got two of them. So cute, I love these. Got this little bowl, probably for fruit, probably for other foods, I don't know, just for like in the middle of the kitchen table. And then I got a litter mat. Next, we got a cutting board. <laughs> oh my gosh, and then these cute oven mitts. Too cute. Bathroom mats. The two pack, so I'm just gonna put one in each bathroom upstairs. Last but not least, I got these super cute for um, right here to put right here on the stove. The witch is in. Stop, these are way too cute. I had to get them. I had to get them. Now I have to go put these away and I'm going to clean the dishes, so wish me luck. I got some flowers today and more shopping. Shopping, 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 shopping. I got a cute lava lamp. Waffle maker. I just washed these to go in the bathrooms. After I put this stuff away, I'm gonna hang my paintings up right on this wall. Just set this up. So this is how it's looking in here. So I got some boxes. I got this cool little roller thing to put upstairs um, and put a lot of like stuff in the like mostly this stuff in there i have like a lot of like arts and crafts crap my my vinyls i think i want to hang like on this wall maybe like right over there and then i got more soap dispensers this one is for down here and i'm gonna put this sponge in this like for the sink so cute and then this is for the other bathroom downstairs I don't think I meant to get all three of these. So now we have an extra one. Well, I guess maybe one we can use for the dish soap. Mm -hmm. Some tissues, just, you know, just in case. I love to get stuff just in case. Some towels to dry your hands off. 
I love the Oreo Thins. These are my favorite. I'm gonna dip these in milk. My little sign says, love you to the moon and back. Chiriso. Chiriso on eggs, so good. And I got Doritos and chili for nachos. And like a pack of gum, just in case anyone who comes over like wants some gum. That's just how I think. <laughs> One of the main things with getting this place is I'm trying not to door dash slash eat out. And then I got these breakfast things. I used to hate these when I was a kid, but maybe I'll like them now. Because I like these from like McDonald's, like the sausage, egg and cheese. I like those, so. Waffle mix and thumbtacks. I have thumbtacks, I just cannot find them. So like I know I'm gonna find them, but I can't find them right now. And the next step is to hang up my paintings and just need to know. And then of course some noodles, duh. I need to get Wi-Fi. Um, probably set that appointment up today. Good morning, everyone. It is August 2nd, and I'm gonna close out this vlog. Look at this bathroom. This is our bathroom and our bedroom. Looking pretty good, pretty good. Put this shower curtain up. This is how my content room is looking. A little messy. I got ready last night and was making content, so it got a little messy, but it's better than before. And then here's my little office slash loft. And then downstairs is looking a lot better. A lot more space. I set up my bookshelf. I think it was yesterday or the day before. Kitchen. Got a lava lamp. That was exciting. Look at it go. Whoa. My mom's coming at 11 today to help me out with stuff. It's 7.44, so I'm just gonna clean up. I have laundry to put away. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really, really hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I'm gonna do another video when everything is finished, of course. I just really wanna get this edited and posted once everything's finished, because my dad is also gonna come on Friday and help us set up our couch and dining room table. Okay, I'm gonna go smoke a blunt, and I hope you guys have a great, beautiful day, and I'll see you next time. Bye!